Could Elon Musk and J.K. Rowling face legal action over their online comments? Algerian boxer Amin Khalif, fresh off her Olympic gold win, has filed a lawsuit naming these high-profile figures in a shocking turn of events. What sparked this bold move, and how does it connect to a global debate on gender in sports? Let's dive into the details. Khalif, who triumphed in the women's 66-kilogram boxing competition at the Paris Olympics, now finds herself in the center of a legal battle after enduring intense scrutiny over her gender. But what led her to take this drastic step? Khalif's attorney, Nabil Boudi, revealed that the lawsuit was filed against Musk's social media platform, X, formerly known as Twitter. The complaint accuses unknown persons of aggravated cyber harassment, but specifically names Musk and Rowling, along with others like former President Donald Trump. So, what did they say? Rowling accused Khalif of being a man after her bout with Italy's Angela Carini, while Musk echoed sentiments from swimmer Riley Gaines, stating that men don't belong in women's sports. Trump also chimed in, vowing to keep men out of women's sports, directly referencing Khalif's match. The backlash against Khalif began after Karini, her opponent, abandoned their fight in just 46 seconds, allegedly due to a broken nose. The controversy surrounding Khalif, who is not transgender but reportedly has XY chromosomes, erupted after she was disqualified from the 2023 World Championships over gender eligibility tests. Despite the outcry, Olympic officials defended their decision to allow Khalif to compete, reaffirming that every person has the right to practice sport without discrimination. Khalif's legal action isn't just a personal fight, it's a significant moment in the broader conversation about gender, sports, and online harassment. As the case unfolds, it could set a precedent for how public figures and platforms are held accountable for their